Hello everyone, welcome to Hobbyist Fishkeeper. I am Will and today's video is going to be an unboxing, a review and a test of the All Pond Solutions Hang On Back 600HO. Um, I've said in the past I'm a big advocate of All Pond Solutions. They're really good quality, they don't break the bank and they work perfectly fine as long as you are setting them up correctly. Uh, I see quite a lot of videos and comments that things don't work as good as what they should do. I'd say eight times out of ten people aren't setting them up properly. Um, anyway, on with the unboxing. So it is the 600 hang on back filter. I'll just pop that down there for now. And it looks like I'm breaking everything. So we have the main hang on back head, it has a detachable top, it has two sponge filters in there, black sponge filters, there are two cartridge filters in here as well with some filter floss on there so they pop in the back and then you've got your up pipe which on there quite snug which is always good when it comes to pipe work having a snug fit um, what did I drop on the floor ah, there we go. so we have the main intake that clips onto there as well with the um, the guard on the bottom so you don't suck up your fish and I'm presuming this oh there we go is a surface skimmer on the side yep there we go floating surface skimmer Dropping everything today. Let's get one of these cartridges in. Oh, so it's got filter floss on both sides, and I'm presuming that is carbon on the inside. Um, Presuming it slides up like that. Take this out so it's easier to slide that one in. Push the foam down nice and snug. That was easy. So I'm going to finish setting this up and then the way I'm going to test it is I'm going to pop it onto this tank which you can see behind me which is extremely cloudy. That's because I've put some aquarium sand in the bottom and I didn't clean it. Um, normally when you put in any kind of substrate you put it in a bucket and you run water through it until the water goes pretty much clear. Now for the purposes of this test I dumped the sand in, filled it up with water, we're going to pop this on the side of it and we're going to time to see how long it takes for it to be as clear as this one. Anyway, on with the testing. Just before I pop this onto the tank, I've just noticed there's a bit of a void in here. I don't know whether you can see that on the camera. Um, there is going to be water sat in there, so you could technically put some more media in there. You could put some ceramic bio rings in there possibly, or some other kind of filter media. That could quite easily fit in there. Pack it with media. You get the better filtration then so yeah little tip if you're going to buy one you put some more media in it jobs are good in. so there we go hang on back or hand on side in this case is now working the uh, surface skimmer floats up quite nicely and the noise that you can actually hear is actually from my air pump which is doing the other sponge filters on all the other tanks so this is quiet as a mouse. You barely hear the water trickling, that's great. So it is 1 p.m. in the UK at the moment. And as you can see, we have a very cloudy tank. I'm gonna keep checking on this every hour, hour and a half. See how clear it goes. Stick with me. Okay everyone, so it's uh, about 7.30 in the morning, um, as you can see, what's that, 7.30, I set it up at 12 o'clock yesterday, is that 18, 18 and a half hours, 19 hours, um, sorry, still half asleep, but you saw how dusty it was before, 
So in less than 24 hours, it's got it pretty clear, to be honest. Um, it is quiet as a mouse. I was going to put a sponge filter on this, but I think I'm just going to leave this on there. Um, the flow is quite nice on it. It's deadly silent. Yeah. Hang on back, all pond solutions, 600 HO. Uh, probably say 10 out of 10. No, nine, we'll go 9 out of 10 because it's not perfect. It's not got a UV light on it. But yeah, 9 out of 10. What do you want for less than 20 quid? Um, thanks for joining me. I'm half asleep and I'm going to go for a coffee. I'll speak to you soon.